Hey y'all, it's Lissa, aka Bangs and Glasses. I'm back with a quick little haul video for you guys. Um, I've gotten some orders in from Etsy this week uh, of fun crafty things that I wanted to show you guys. Um, so let's get started. And I will of course um, link down below the Etsy shops of um, where I've been shopping. So the first uh, store I've shopped at is called Only One Life Creations. Um, there's their card and all their info there if you want to just pause and um, look them up that way. But I will also link it down below in the description. Um, so I picked up more pieces from the Simple Stories Cozy Days collection. Um, if you've been watching my videos, you'll know that I recently picked up just the um, essentials like uh, collection kit um, from a local store to me so I wanted to get a few more pieces of the collection so I can play with it for fall um, so in her shop she had the journal bits which I did not have this is what they look like really cute I also got the six by eight paper pad um, and you do get two of each sheet and they are double sided. I wanted to make sure I had enough um, paper to play with on this since I just had the um, collector's kit and it just repeats. And then I got the collector's essential kit. I was really excited to pick this up. I think she had this for only like $20 um, or something like that. How much was this? Um... It does not say. Uh, but this total order was about uh, $38 including uh, shipping. So, um, But I got the uh, Collector's Essential Kit. So I get all the papers and the stickers, the bits and pieces, die cuts, the washi tape, and the um, chipboard stickers. So I definitely think I have enough. Oops to play with now with this collection. So I was glad that I found that. Um, the next shop is a shop that I've never shopped at before, but I know lots of people do, um, which is my scrap cabin, um, where everyone gets their fun seam binding. I wanted to pick some up to decorate um, junk journals that I'm making. So I picked up a couple packs um, and I got a freebie as well. Um, so I will show you guys um, what each color looks like and the name of each color. Um, but these are so pretty. They're way prettier in person than I ever imagined they would be. And they came packaged so well. So I wanted to get some like vintagey looking colors since I'm working uh, with junk journals. This is actually my freebie, um, which is called Ocean, this really pretty deep blue. Um, I believe I got a couple of the same colors uh, just in those packs. I was trying to get a variety of colors. Um, I really wanted to pick up a red, but they were out. Um, it looked like they were pulled out of a lot of the colors when I um, was shopping. So. Uh, just be aware of that if you go check out their shop they are um, selling out really quickly so this is ocean and then let's start with the pinks i'll just go in kind of rainbow order here that will make me happy just going in rainbow order and then we got the blue okay so this is my beautiful rainbow of seam binding that I have now. Um, so this pink is called Caviar. This one is Dusty Pink. This is Tulip. This one is a Ballerina. These two may even be the same. Let's check. This is Peach Blossom. Yep, so these are the same peach blossom. And then we have Daylily. These are um, both spring green. And 
grass, which is one that I really wanted to pick up. And then this blue is sky blue. And then lace blue. And then this one was ocean, which was my freebie. So that is going to tide me over for a while, I think, unless I start just making junk journals like crazy. But those are so pretty. Um, definitely check out her shop down below. Okay, and then... Last but not least, I have a like sequin mix and embellishment order that I picked up recently um, from the Magical Mixery store. Um, she had really cute sequin mixes, um, so that is what I got from her as well as some uh, just other little packs. Um, so I did get some sets of buttons. So I got these black and white buttons um, that remind me of carousel and these cute little gold glitter stars. I did get some Halloween sequin mixes. So I got this one, which is called pastel haunting. I love the little um, tombstones and spiders in there. And then I got this one called web weaver really cute and she had really great pricing as well okay um i also got i think i got another one of these yes i got these really cute little teeny tiny puffy um hearts let me show you what they look like size wise okay so this one little gold glitter heart you can see they are so tiny um smaller than my pinky really cute i think you get 18 for like a dollar 50 and then i also just got the regular uh gold little hearts everything came packaged really well in these cute little baggies um the other halloween mix i got is this one and this cute little ghost tin I don't remember what this one is called, but that's what it looks like. It has little clay skulls in there or ghosts. Um, and it's like a purpley mix. Um, I also got, let me get some of these baggies out of the way so I don't miss anything. I also got this little um, pack, which was for Valentine's Day. And it comes with these cut apart cards um, as well as the sequin mix. I thought they were cute. So this is the sequins mix. And then it comes with these cute little vintage looking cut apart cards. Oh, I like that one. Never too early to stock up for Valentine's Day. Little monkey. Yep, and that's all of them. So I got that. Um, I did get two sheets of thickers from her. I got this one, which is from the Maggie Holmes Shine collection. I have never had this before, so I thought I'd grab it. And I also got this number set, which is perfect for like a December daily or Christmas. So I grabbed that one, it's called 25 Days. And then these are the little freebies she sent me. I always appreciate when shops do that. Um, so this is like a carousel looking mix. And then this one is kind of like galaxy, moon, and stars. So those are really cute as well. So that is everything I picked up recently from Etsy. Again, I will make sure I link them down below. Uh, let me know what your favorite thing was um, in this video. And I'll see you again next time. Bye.